for his first off-lead session. And I would ordinarily work on um, not pushing through the open door, but um, I actually uh, don't mind if he goes through the store because he's been uh, nervous enough about working out here. Okay, good boy. That I don't want to squash anything. So <clears throat> I've got him on a 10 on his collar. And this is his first off lead outing into the big world. Good boy. Hi, bud. Hey, Milo. Good boy. That's it. Good boy. Yes. Good boy. Come on, Milo. Come on. So I haven't pushed any buttons on him. Good boy. Good boy. I want him to get comfortable. Good boy. Come on, Milo. That a boy, that a boy, that a boy. That's it. That's it. I do a lot on his own time. Good boy. There you go. There you go. Good boy. Let him decide how fast we go through things. Excellent. Good boy. Excellent. Good boy. So I've done some foundation work with him on um, off lead and uh, started with a long line and then I worked him in that small little yard over there. Um, <clears throat> that was this morning. And so we're gonna find out how that all went. Good boy. Let him get a little bit distracted here. Good boy, that's it, good, excellent, good boy. I'm very happy with this engagement, good boy. Because he can be so nervous about things, good boy. Good boy, yeah. And I really had no idea how he was gonna feel about coming out here into an unfamiliar place. <clears throat> he definitely seems to like routine. Good boy. Milo. Good boy. So I haven't pushed any buttons. I'm just talking to him. Um, giving him a little bit of food when he comes back to me. And just trying to make this a super positive experience for him. <clears throat> I will add in a little bit of collar pressure. Good boy, all right, good boy, good boy. Excellent, Milo, good boy, all right, good boy. So I'm gonna walk him back to the front step of the kennel again and call him off of that since he was reluctant to do so. I'll just give him the experience of good boy, of uh, Success, really. Atta boy. Yeah, I'm happy with this. Happy with this. Good boy, Milo. Good boy. All right. Come on, bud. Good boy, that's it. Come on, buddy. Good boy. Excellent. Very good. Very good. It is hot today. I just opened up the kennel about an hour ago. Good boy, Milo. Good, and he's already this hot. <clears throat> Had the air on all day. Fantastic, that's a boy, very good. All right, I feel very comfortable with him feeling comfortable. So I'm going to uh, start introducing a little bit of collar pressure here. And I actually just decided to turn him down to a five. I certainly do not want to overwhelm him. 
And I'm always guessing at the number that I'm going to use until until something is um, really ingrained. So because this is the first off lead, off lead, off lead um, in the yard this morning, we were on a 10, but I can always go up to a 10. So I'm going to start on a five. I'm walking him up here to this fence line in hopes that he'll get interested in something on it. Oh yeah, good boy. Good boy, he's nicely tuned in, that's great. There you go, good boy, good boy. All right, come on bud. Take that as a distraction. Milo. Hey, good boy. All right. Good. Good job. Oh, that's even better. Good boy. All right. Good boy. Okay. Come on, bud. Coming up and sitting. Excellent. Exactly what I'm looking for. Milo. All right, good boy. Excellent. That's a boy. That's perfect. Oh, you are a good boy. Milo, good boy. Okay, come on. That a boy. So it doesn't happen very often that I have a session where I'm trying to introduce the remote collar on this exercise and I don't get the opportunity because the dog is actually responsive just to his name but he's doing it good boy he's doing it I'm trying to give him as much confidence as I possibly can because that's what he's lacking he's just not a confident puppy good boy no. good boy Good boy. All right. Good dog. Good boy. Milo. Excellent. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Yeah. Yeah. Good boy. Oh boy. Yeah. Good boy. Okay. Come on. Good. 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 All right. I'm going to turn my camera off. You can see him. He's happy. He's doing what I want him to do. Milo, I would change it. He's a little skinny. He's eating a massive amount of food, but he's not putting on much weight, which is not terribly unusual with young shepherds. Um, <clears throat> he's eating almost, what, eight cups of food a day, four in the morning, four at night, and he's still a little bit thin. Good boy. All right, I'm going to take him in. He's hot. I'm going to give him some water um, and let him rehydrate. But that's, that's him. He's looking good. I'm happy with him. 